In the first season of One Hour Limit Locked, we set ourselves the challenge to get a fire cape in 45 days while only being able to play for one hour a day. I went 36 minutes overtime on the last day, but we got our cape in the end. The thing is, that was only the warm up. Now, we're really about to start cooking. 60 days are on the clock, 175 quest points are on the menu, 8 council members are in need of a charming knight in shining armour, and I'm the idiot they're getting. Welcome to season 2 of One Hour Limit Locked, it's chef in season baby. Hello there everyone, we are at the top of day 6, about to kick things off here. I started the dig site yesterday and I plan to finish it first thing today. After that, I'm veering a little from my initial direction. I was planning to go into some mining quests after that, or some quests that would reward mining XP at least, to aim for f level 40 so that we could do the watchtower quest for 15,000 magic XP. That was the plan, because I wanted to boost my magic to a higher level earlier. But with the way our magic training's been going, it's actually been going pretty good. I'm not sure we really need to prioritize that at the same amount. Our cash stack on the other hand is looking pretty shite. And I would like to put some time today towards investing in a method that will provide a little bit of daily income that should be enough to sustain us through whatever questing and such that we're doing. That being birdhouses. So I'm gonna try and get Bone Voyage done today. I'm also gonna have to try and get to 21 construction so I can build the bank chest on Fossil Island. So that's my main goal. Dig site, we need to get up to 100 kudos by cleaning stuff and then Bone Voyage, 21 construction, it's a lot to get through, but I, I think we can do it, and if not, we can certainly get close. So that is the plan. If I remember correctly, I need to grab some energy from the bank, and I also need to get an alcohol stack, and maybe some runes, I'm not sure. So I'm going to do that right away, and then head over to the museum for the next step of the quest. We can also check our kudos while we're there. If my calculations are right, it should be on 53, which means with five uncleaned finds afterwards in the museum, after we've done the dig site quest, we should be able to get up to 103, which is enough for Bone Voyage. That's the plan. Lego! Okay, I have runes, but I need Alex and energy. And a vial? We don't have much there, actually. Is that all our... Uh... Surely it's not just those play skirts. We had loads of stuff. Where are all my elk stacks gone? Do I need to buy more? I'm tripping, right? We got some shields. Wow, that's it. Okay, I'm actually just going to go to the G and buy some more elk stacks. Alright, that'll do. Okay, back to Vark Center. Ooh, we only have 38 kudos at the minute. I thought we had more than that. We might just need to go and talk to the guy upstairs. For it to top. Sick. There we go, 53. That is what I expected. Alright, we're going to the exam center. There's a lot running around in this. Well, it's 44 magic. We actually need 49 to be able to make a dig site necklace. Come to think of it. So, maybe we do need a lot more magic XP after all. Because that would have been my main way. I was hoping to make one today. I need to figure that out, like, immediately. Gosh damn. What is going on? I didn't want a spade. Okay, we got a brush. Yeah, there's no way we're getting all this done today. Already failing at the first hurdle. Maybe I should have got my thieving level higher. Okay. So I can boost with a wizard's mind bomb. I'm not sure how high that'll take me. But maybe by the time... We've done all this with the Alkin. We just keep Alkin the whole way. Perhaps by the time we want to enchant it, we'll be able to. 
Or maybe I could just like buy a magic potion. I could probably do that, right? Awesome. So I think there's three of those exams, if I remember correctly. That's the first one done. Yeah, exam three, and then there's a bit after. Okay, back for the second exam. That one's a lot quicker, that step. Alright, back we go. Final exam. Oh, man. There's something with the animation for Low Alk that, like, stalls your character. But, like, when things are loading, it's just really, really annoying. Okay. Now we are on to Discovery. We're actually getting through this relatively quickly. Having, like, energy and stamina potions definitely helps. Because, like, I remember this being a pain doing it on an Iron Man. Just having, like, the stamina, the energy, the teleports to get here makes it so much easier. We're getting there. Almost done. Another couple of minutes. Almost out of my alks as well, so it's a good job. Okay, so I need to use this on him. Oh, on the powder. Cool, we got our bomb. Use the bomb. In we go. Take my prize. No boulders? No rolling boulders? Okay. Guess I'm better than Indy. And here we are, we are about to finish. Okay, I need to look up magic boost, see how much potion gives me. Magic potion gives me four. I need 49. So I'd need one more level, which I'm basically almost at. Awesome, that is a whole bunch of mining XP. We are gonna teleport a couple of times. And then go to the Ferox Enclave. Back to Varrock. There we go, 45. Okay. So I'm gonna get a magic potion, hopefully. Plus four, perfect. We don't actually need it immediately. Just dump all this shit. I dumped my worn items instead, I'm an idiot. Okay, we will need this. Don't know if we need the trowel or not, I can't remember. We want uh, leather gloves on actually, plus boots. Okay, we need both of those, and oh, we need the other shit. I almost didn't look at my cash stack now. 110k? Oh gosh, that is awful, isn't it? And get leather boots and I can get them out of the exam center, it's fine. Okay, we want our bar crawl card eventually. Not really right now though. Don't want this on because we need the free space. I think we just want to get our rune pouch. Okay, that'll be fine. Alright, back to Farrock. It is time to do... See, I don't even know if I'm going to be able to walk, really. Probably not, but time to do some uh, fossil cleaning. Okay, we take ourselves a cleaning kit. We get this. I don't know if we need the trowel, so yeah, we do. Okay. And then we spam click this. Okay. And then we spam. Wait, can you not spam click these? Oh no, I thought you could. Okay, the pottery is one thing that we need. Don't need it twice though. Okay, we want pottery, old symbol, ancient symbol, ancient coin, old coin. And the clean necklace as well. Old symbol's another one there. Okay, so we got most of them. Four out of five, I think. Just have to show them all to Pottery is 22. Which one's this one? 45. That's the old coin. Boom. This one is 36. That is the old symbol. Boom. This one. 44. That is the ancient coin. We don't have that one. 37. Is that ancient symbol? Yep. I think this one's the Pottery one, isn't it? 22. Yep. Okay. Excellent. And we still do need the dig site necklace. Oh, we got a lamp! That's nice! That is very nice indeed. I don't know how much XP this is. I think we probably... <sighs> ay, 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 ay. I think we probably put it in a gel. It's only 500. Alright. So I think the only thing we need is the other coin, the ancient coin, and then the clean necklace. And then we're done with this and we can actually start Bone Voyage. Mm. There's a clean necklace. In fact, I'm going to go ahead and show that straight away. Excellent. Nothing else there. Okay, just that one coin. 
And then we can do Bon Voyage. Come on, give me that coin. I could get the kudos on the waiters as well, there's plenty of quests, but they give like five each and I'd need to do two of them, so this is just the easiest way to get up to a hundred if you don't just have absolute garbage. I feel like we have to put things in here because it has that chance of a 500 XP lamp, which is not to sniff at. Just give me that ancient coin, boy! Let's go! We got it. Wait, can I? Oh, you have to destroy it. All right. So it's that one in it. There we go. We can start Bon Voyage. Right, I don't think there's anything else to get from this guy, but can't harm to check. Nope, all good. This chick may have some XP for me though. Yes. Let's go. 2,500 crafting and some mining XP. Okay, okay. Right, what we actually need to do now is get these... Uh, ruby amulets, sword, uh, ruby necklaces even. So I should have bought some, but let's go, GE. I think I'm just gonna get like 10. Okay, and we need some cosmic runes as well though. Let's get 100. All right, so deposit, draw out. We've already got fire runes. We need our magic potion though. There it is, excellent. Okay, we are gonna wear a dig site pendant. Check if there's anything else we need for the quest. I don't think there's a lot of skills necklace. We've got Varrock Telly, we've got Glory, Hammer, Iron Bar. Well, we're not going to need that yet anyway, so it's all good. A couple planks, that's for after. Like, that is for after. We probably want back roll card. We've got a bit of money. <laughs> got all our money. That is all our money, not a bit of money. That is all the money, James. Do something about that. This isn't me doing something about it. This is me doing what I was planning to do anyway. Alright, so, boom. We can now go to the dig site. Didn't get any stamina, but it's okay. Go talk to my man. Uh, what, what's the... I, I want to... Why isn't he... Did I need something on me? What the fuck? Do I need an order for him? Was there an item that the guy gave me? I don't even have a jeweling ring. Okay, we got our back rolled on there. What is it that this guy gave me that I need to give him? Lumber, wood, what? What is going on here? I must speak to the foreman at the back. Oh, no way, I was just talking to the wrong fucking guy. I'm so fucking stupid. I'm so fucking stupid. I skipped a step. Wow. That's gonna cost me. I'm not gonna finish this quest today. I don't think I was gonna anyway with the construction training that we also need to do, but how's the back roll card looking? We got Sears and Brim to do, that's it. Okay. Right. Uh someone's got all the nails. I'm just gonna buy these ones because they're cheaper. In fact, should we just hop a couple times, buy some nails? Because we are broke as a bitch. And I don't think we're gonna get all this done today, so I'm not stressing about it. Whatever nails we have left over, we can just sell them when we're done with everything. So we have bought our own most worlds by the looks of it. I might just go to the PvP worlds to check those. And even this one's bought out. Even the high risk world. Oh well, I'll just top one more. Okay, got plenty of nails. Uh, let's go to What am I doing with my life? Honestly. Boom, straight back. Boom. Okay, port, sarin, pub. Okay, Drano. Okay, back to the barge. Right, I'm actually just gonna send this on a teleport even though it's just there. I think that's worth. Cause I'm not gonna make the voyage until I've got my construction up to 21 anyway. So, probably be banking and shit before all that. Maybe we do actually get this done. I don't know, it depends how long this construction takes me. Need like 11 levels. Okay, so I've got all the stuff now, so I'm gonna go and get the construction levels. Which means we need to teleport to house, we need all of our planks, to the bronze ones because we got a fucking million. We need some cash actually, and that might be it. We don't actually need all of the, our room pouch, we can just take this to save invent space. Perfect.
I'm gonna go outside so I can enter in build mod. Oh no, I didn't realise I couldn't have scurry. It's gonna fuck the invents this. Alright, so we want a kitchen. Whatever rotation in it, it's fine. We're also gonna want a workshop. I don't know if we can build that yet. Nope. Okay. So the kitchen first. Man, the regular ones are so slow. Oh my gosh. It's taking so long just to make one ladder. That was ridiculous. I guess it has to patch a bunch of different checks in a row, right, for the nails. So maybe making smaller items is better for the earlier levels. I think that makes sense. Right, oh, where is my man? There he is. Ah, oh, I didn't go in and build mode, I'm done. I'm gonna change that to, oh, not friend's house, to build mode. Okay, let's try chairs, not rug, chair, one chair. That's 13, I think 15 is what we need to get to, to use oak in the workshop. Maybe I should have just done curtains or something, that might have been quicker because no nails. Will one ladder be enough? Don't think it will. I think we need to use all of these pretty much. Okay, so I only need like three of these. Should hopefully be enough. Let's go. Okay, so we can make a workshop. And then we don't have to worry about this, it's going to be much quicker from here. Because we won't have to wait for the nails and shit. We just build. Remove. Build. Remove. Till we get to 21. Uh, we can use our planks up faster now at this workbench space by... Is it not this one? Maybe it's the clock making space? Yep, crafting table one. Oh my god, what is that upgrade option? That is such bullshit. Don't want to upgrade it, I want to remove it, that's why I click the remove button. Fucking idiot. The fact that it's making me click remove every single time is absolute bullshit. We're almost there. I think we might actually get our first bird house set up today, which will mean we might have some bird nests waiting for us when we log in in the morning, which would be very, very nice. And there we are, that is our 21 construction. Don't know why I'm leaving there. We need to go to get an energy reset. Don't have a jeweling ring on me, so this is how we're doing it. And now is where we want to bring our two oak planks. I'm bar five. Let's go with ten just in case. I don't know if they can break, but. Uh, and then we need what? Sea legs. We need the. Uh, Bone charm. Yep. Get some stamp. Don't know if we need stamp, but whatever. Yep, that'll all do. Oh, we need dig site pendant. Might be a struggle to actually get the birdhouse to sell because we have to unlock the transport system as well. Mushrooms. Welcome to the new skill, everybody. Sailing. This is how it works. You go full speed. Say so nobody got time to waste. Wait, why am I on course? I can't tell which way I'm going. Oh, I'm trying to get this arrow to point up. That's what I'm trying to do. I understand. I forgot how this mini game worked for a minute. I was trying to get this arrow to point up. I'm done with shit. Just wasted like two minutes there, I think. Almost done. He says as it starts plummeting again. What the fuck is wrong with this thing? And by this thing, I mean my brain and my hands. Am I steering the wrong way? I don't know what's... I'm turning right, like... Come on. Is it inverted? I'm so confused. What the fuck is going on? How am I... I'm back to red. This is awful. Thank fuck. Holy shit. Okay, you need to take me to the, take me to the island, take me to the island, take me to the island, island. Build, don't need that. Beautiful, we got our bank chest. We can get ourselves our clockwork, our logs, and our seeds that we forgot to buy. We also need a chisel. We don't need a saw. We don't need two hammers. Don't have a chisel either, that's okay, we're going to there, but we are going to unlock the system first. Uh, at least the lithium tele the 
one up here, the house on the hill. Don't think we're going to get our bird house to sell today, unfortunately, but we should be able to at the start of tomorrow. Okay, so we have to use a pendant on... Is it this one? No, it's that one. The one with the picture of the dig site pendant on it, dummy. Perfect. Now we can teleport back here. Now we can teleport with this mush tree. We get some potato seeds. And then we're gonna slap our nails on the GE. Get a bit of cash back out of them. Okay, so we're at 255k. We actually did alright there. And we'll just get the stuff out ready for tomorrow. Because that is time on the day. Well, folks, I got pretty much what I wanted to do done. We've just got to unlock the other mush trees now on Fossil Island. And I forgot chisel. 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 Uh, we need to just get back there, unlock the mush trees, and set up our very first birdhouse runs. Which we could possibly claim tomorrow at the end of the session, depending on if we want to make the trip back there. But basically my plan is to just do the birdhouses once per day. Any nests we get are worth like 7k a pop and it should give us some passive income. We'll also get our hunter level up a bit. Not that that's in any way relevant, but it is what it is. Birdhouses, good money as long as you get those nests and we're hoping to get some. Yeah, other than that, we got the dig site and bone voyage done, which were both quests on our list anyway, so it's something that needed doing, and I think the construction was also a requirement. I needed 20 construction for the Fremenic Isles at some point, so the fact that we've got that out of the way, there wasn't really an easier way to do it, we're going to have to train it at some point, it's nice to have that grind done, we don't have to worry about construction now for the rest of the account. Pretty, pretty decent day. I'm pretty happy with it. We got up to 35 mining as well from 18. So that is a big jump there. 17 levels gained today. What are doing any other XP? We got a bunch of magic XP up to 45. That's two more levels. 11 construction levels. Nothing too much else. Maybe a crafting level there. Yeah, we got a crafting level there. Need to get that to 50, so that is progress. Not quite a level uh, a herb law level as well. Target 45 there. Yeah, pretty decent day. Pretty decent day. And almost got access to that money maker of the birdhouses, so very nice indeed. If you enjoyed the episode, please do leave a like on the video and give me a comment down below. Like, I'm kind of feeling a bit lonely. It's felt a bit quiet lately, so yeah. Hope everyone's still enjoying it and shit. Like, still good, right? <laughs> I'm having fun still. I hope you all are. Until the next time, though, whenever that is, look after yourself. Be lovely to one another. I'll see you on the next one. Whenever that is, it's going to be tomorrow. What mind about? Take it easy.